Hi guys, my name is Church, and today we're going to be looking at the XFX Radeon R9 270 graphics card with 2 gigs of GDDR5 RAM. Included in the box you have some warnings, a lifetime warranty card from XFX, a quick installation guide, a driver slash CD install guide, the actual installation disk for the drivers. Always update your drivers at the XFX or AMD website for graphics cards. A brochure about XFX power supplies. And another little half advertisement, kind of half things you want to know, because it does tell you how to do multiple displays and what adapters you're going to need for that, which is pretty handy, so it's actually nice to have. The card itself features a mostly black design. You have a black shroud, black 90mm fan, black top, black PCB. You have heat pipes on the inside directing heat away from the RAM and from the main processing chip. You have a 6-pin PCI power on the back, only one 6-pin. It's a pretty low power card as far as consumption goes. And then for display ports, you have two DVI, and those are both with analog and digital. You have a display port and an HDMI port. This runs in the PCI Express slot. 3.0 is the best one you can do right now, although 2.0 wouldn't be too bad if you're running anything lower than that. Upgrade. And then there is a Crossfire finger. Although newer versions of Crossfire, you won't have to use an actual bridge. It'll do it just in the PCI lanes. This is just going to be a quick overview. Because, whether or not you know this or not, but the R9-270 graphics card is basically the exact same thing as the Radeon HD-7870. So this graphics card hasn't changed a whole lot in about two years. This is fairly common with graphics cards. A lot of AMD's offerings this generation have been rebrands of the last generation. Uh, the same goes for NVIDIA, too. Like, the 760 is the same thing as a 670. And a 770 is the same thing as a 680. So that's why this was a quick overview, because it's kind of an old card by new standards, I guess. So give us a like if you like this, subscribe, and then uh, tell me how you feel about rebrands. Did you even know it happened? So have a good one.